Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Splatoon 2. Now, I, my, 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 my profile's not very impressive, but I have a box to open here. You got the Octo -layer, Layered LS. You can wear it in multiplayer battles. Because I got the Octo expansion now. Got the Studio Octophones. Got some new gear. But also now, if I go this way... We can go back here, I believe, we can listen closely to this, we can enter, enter the story that, that echoes up from the deep underground. So let's go in here. Pale summer moonlight shimmers on the seafloor, an octopus unaware that dawn will bring capture. Rest within a trap, dreaming fleeting dreams. Ahoy, ahoy, Octoling! Up and at him, you lazy wa <laughs> wiffle wa waffle. This fight ain't over. Prepare for a royal whoopin'. Man, those eyes look familiar, staring into my soul. But there's no honor in defeating an unarmed opponent, and you seem to have lost your weapon somewhere around here. And just where is here, anyway? Last thing I remember, you were battling my... protege. Agent 3 in Octa Valley, when both of you were suddenly attacked by someone. And somehow we got marooned here. So, uh, how's about we call a temporary truce while we find a way to escape? But where are my manners? I haven't even told you my name. I'm Captain Cuttlefish, leader of the legendary new Squid Beaks Platoon. And you are... This is the part where you tell me your name. By Kraken, you lost your memory when you hit the ground? You can't remember anything about yourself. Anything at all? Well, now we get to select our Octoling character. Basically, it works the same way as our Inkling character, basically, so. Let's go with that. I'm sure we can probably change it later, maybe. I don't know. I assume. Most interesting. I noticed you were humming the calamari incantation right before you came to. Could it be? Has this heavenly melody been etched into into your very own your very soul? I'll take your stunned silence as a yes. I've heard a tell of Octarians whose souls were attached by those squidtastic grooves. Or etched by the Squidtastic Grooves. But that was a couple of years back, during Agent 3's battle with DJ Octavio. Still, I can't shake the feeling that this is so related somehow. In any case, sorry for us, uh, sicking Agent 3 on you back there. Any fan of the, the Squid Sisters is a friend of mine. I mean, that I mean that with all my, my hearts. Now, dust yourself off and find your land legs. We need to get moving. Let's find a way out of here. So the captain has been, or Captain Cuttlefish is down here. In the deep underground. And Agent 3 is nowhere to be seen. Not much going on here. How about heading up that ramp? This place looks abandoned. Agent 3 and I were keeping a vigilant watch over Octa Valley. Where in the world has Agent 3 disappeared to? I'm too too old for this. My back hurts. Not much going on here. Okay. Captain Cuttlefish is great. But anyway. Set up this way. I love the way that this area looks. It's got such a cool atmosphere of being... I, I, I love the, like, un the, the deep underground feel. Also, what's with like the... Light reflection on the ceiling. That's cool. 
Let's get on this, uh, train here. Look around. We can go into octoling form, or it's oct octopus form, I guess. I don't know. It's like squid form, but it's... We're an octopus. Also, we have a thing on our back, which looks really cool. I don't know where I'm going, but I'm just gonna go this way. We need a key for something over there. So I'm assuming this is supposed to be like a test area. What in the devilfish is this place? Proceed with caution. This place is really cool. Hey, that's an Octarian vault. You need a key to open it. Being an Octarian and all, you sure this place doesn't look familiar? Like the, the, the regular levels are underground, obviously, but this feels like deep underground and it's really cool. It's down on this to activate that. Interesting. Since we don't have any ink to, well, any guns, any weapon. Which, speaking of weapon, weapons, we get the Splattershot Jr. and Splat Bomb here. So we actually don't have a set weapon for the stages here. We just have given weapons. But yeah, that contraption back there, it's a go. It's gone. Anyway, we can just shoot everything with this now. It's got an interesting spread on it. Doesn't seem like any other Octarians are here. This pl place might be abandoned. Find that key. I like these, like, boxes that look different. Because they're, like, inflated targets or something. I really love the way that this looks. Can I hit that? Yes, I can. I don't think I can hit that, but I can hit all these. Maybe. If I play my cards right. I have to destroy everything. It's just the way that I am. I'm pretty sure- that might be what it wants me to do. Possibly. Or it might just want me to look around more. But there are so many things that I could do, so... Okay, this is going up this way. I kind of like the idea of an open world Splatoon game now. Which Splatoon 3 might be. I don't know. But this feels open right now. Even though it's not really. Anyway, we've got this key now. Then we can head back to the vault. Just make sure there's nothing else that I need to worry about. There's a gusher there. There's, there's just different ways to do things in this area, I guess. But anyway. Let's head back this way. I think we lose our weapon, though. Going back this way, so... That contraption stole your weapon back. Bunch of hooey, if you ask me. Also, the music is really cool. This looks a little sketchy, but you're gonna have to check it out. I love the music right now. I don't think I've heard the music from the Octoling expansion. So I'm enjoying it in my ear right now. This place is so cool. Well, we found a way out. Sort of. Uh... I love this place. Like, this, I love Splatoon. But this place just feels so different and it's so cool. Where the heck are we? This place gives me the willies. Got any Krabby Cakes? Just, just randomly ask if you have Krabby Cakes. This isn't ominous or anything. Let's answer the phone. Searching for user ID. User 10,008 confirmed. Greetings! 10,008. Your current location is Deep Sea Metro Central Station. My primary function is to uh, facilitate your journey to the promised land. Pleased to make your acquaintance. A certain communication, communication efficiency, efficiency 12.42%. Enabling contemporary speech mode. What is crackling, home skillet? Let's- let us bounce to the promised land, for sure. I'm about it- about it. So listen while I- Slang not found. You the facts. You have spent your entire life in the dark, your eyes closed to the new ho hotness that awaits. The promised land. A utopia of light beyond your water streams. It is all that and a bag- <laughs> a bag of cool beans. I will take you to the promised land now. Not 
Ha ha, psyched out. Only cats who have proven themselves can error the promised land. Do you dig, dog? There have been 10,007 applicants so far, which makes you applicant 10,008. This opportunity comes once in a lifetime, yo. Good luck and slang not found. This is the Deep Sea Metro S Central Station. The really, really Odelio, central hub of the facility. Here is your CQ80 and CQ card. They are so bad. Guard them with your life, with your little, this life. Ugh. Because if you lose them, you'll be error. Now come on and ride the train, Audi 5000. Applicant 10,008, eh? That's a big fool. I think I'll just call you Agent 8. I think we're skipping a few numbers there, but that's fine. That's cool. This promised land must be the, the surface. I wonder how deep underground we are. There's no time to waste. Come on, Agent 8. Grab those new dearly does And get moving. I really like the idea of not knowing how far underground we are. That, that's what I like about Portal as well, because that's underground, I'm pretty sure. And I mean, you go deeper into that, so you really don't know how deep underground you are. Man, this background looks really cool. <laughs> that's a cool loading screen. I'm pooped, Agent 8. Gotta rest my cuddle bones here for a bit. Look at him. <laughs> Look at him. Thank you for using Deep Sea Metro today. I'm your humble conductor, Sea Cucumber. You gotta be squitting me, a talking sea slug. Pardon me? I take it this is your first time riding with us. Here's the deal. We're in the vast underground facility operated by the Camabo Cam Corporation. It's a series of test chambers connected by the Deep Sea Metro subway system. I see that you're in possession of a CQ-80 device. I take it your aim is to reach the promised land. That's right, we want, ahead we want out of here. Understood. The promised land is a paradise to which we denizens of the depths are forbidden entry. To reach it, you must pass a test at each deep sea metro station. You must also find and collect the four thangs. When all four thangs have been gathered, the door to the promised land shall open. So we gotta get. So all we gotta do is pass some tests and find some thangs. And we can go home? I believe so. Let me show you your first test. Press X to activate your CQ-80. Oh, what in the blazes? Technology these days. This is the Deep Sea Metro map. Go ahead and select a destination. Looks like the real thing. Fake plastic station. Very good. Now departing for the first test. I love that loading screen. At each station, the available weapons will be displayed atop the equipper. CQ points are ready to be to take out to take each test. Are required to take each test. We grant you we'll grant you a thousand to start with. The test fee indicates the number of CQ points needed to take the test. So we need to 
pay 100 out of our thousand to play when you have three lives. The reward is how many CQ points you'll earn for passing the test. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, the reward is 600, okay. Underneath the, the weapon, okay. Now go ahead and press A to select a weapon. So this will be interesting. This area is where we're in now is called a station platform. You can find me here at each stop. If you like more info about a certain test, come back to talk. <laughs> come talk to me. I'm always happy to help. To pass this test, you must shoot and then touch the goal. The visibility here is quite poor, so be careful. Good luck. Okay, we're pretty, pretty good damage, but maybe a bit slow. This is a turn cycle. It's turn style. Press A to pay the test fee and begin the test. If you don't have enough CQ points to take a test, you have to come back to it. There we go. Three lives, so let's be careful. Get to the goal. Trees. Man, this subway is weird. Okay, so those fish eggs are also increasing our CQ points. Target acquired. Octolings are your friends, right? Maybe try talking to them. Destroy. Egad, are they really going to attack a fellow Octoling? You might want to talk a little louder. I love how that glitched out, like that, as they despawned. The gate is open, I guess talking to them was a good idea after all. Also some armor, that looks cool. Oh my goodness, I have a helmet now. Okay. I like this atmosphere. Again, just everything is really cool down here. Like even everything's like slightly different as well. It's so fresh. Seek and destroy. More trouble, double trouble. Okay, one's got umbrella. Interesting. Need to be careful. Thank you. I love that, like, the glitch out effect that happens around them when they despawn. Oh, you got a brush. Thing, roller, that's the one. Seems like they'd be friendly to you, yet they're attacking. Well, whatever, the next gate has opened, so you gotta move on. This place feels really cool. Okay, I think I actually got some pretty good armor right now. Got a splash down. I like this, like, laser tag feel to this place. Seek and destroy! Ah! Oh, hello! Don't panic! Hide in the trees! <laughs> Phew, you made it somehow. Thanks for the confidence. Oh, the big door. Get us open! This is the way out! Just need to spray this thing. Octarians hunting Octarians. What does the world come to? But we spray this and then we can just grab it. Oh, hang on. When the goal is activated, touch it to pass the test. And we get a little reward as well. Congratulations, you passed your first test. By the way, you received this memento when you finished. It's called a mem cake. Mem cakes are formed by compressing memories into physical form. They'll be awarded to you by Kamaboko to commemorate each test you pass. Use L and R in your CQ80 menu to check out your collection of mem cakes. New stations are now available for you to visit and test your skills within. You can move freely to any station marked with a orange dot. Safe travels. Huh? Is this thing working? Oh, I hear something. Come in, Agent 3. Agent 3, do you copy? Mic check 1-2. Who the heck are you? Excuse me? Pearl, didn't anyone teach you to respect your elders? Huh? Who am I speaking to? Where is Agent 3? State your names. Uh, I think you- I asked you first, dude. Anyway, I'm Pearl. 
but you can call me MC Dot Princess. Or MC Princess, yeah, I, I, you can ignore the dot. I can ignore the dot. My deets, I'm short and sweet. I spit that fire, I make po poses perspire. Step to my game, I'll bring the pain. I'm never shook because I'm off the hook. Oh ho, check it, kid. Are you stepping to me with a rap battle? MC Craig in the house. Call me Captain Cuttlefish, but that not because I cuddle cuttlefish. Oh, it went away. Oh, I'm sad because I wanted to read that. Okay, you two, that's enough. Mr. Cuttlefish, was it? We found a radio here and heard your transmission. We're currently on M Mount Nantai. Where are you ca calling from? Mount Nantai? That's... why well, that's near Octa Valley. Agent Ace and I were there. Near there. But someone seems to have taken us deep underground. I see. So you and this Agent 8 don't know where you are. Sorry to hear that. But worry not. From now on, you'll have me, Marina, aka DJ Hyperfresh, supporting you. I'll get to work analyzing your surroundings, and hopefully I'll be of some help to you. I don't really get what's going on, but, but hang tight. We got you. Okay, well, anyone who loves rapping is a friend of mine. Thanks for your help. We're off to pass some sort of tests, and make our way to the promised land. And by we, I mean Agent 8. Time to get after it. I love that the, the, the Captain Cuttlefish is just a fan of rap, apparently. <laughs> That's just such a cool, random thing. Anyway, we have an option to go to the different levels that have opened up now. So let's go to A04, because these all have different IDs on which line they're on. Because I think this is... L l like... Yeah. <laughs> It, 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 it'll make more sense, but this is, yeah, because this, this line of track is A, and it's all yellow, so each one has a, a number on it. So the start of the line is actually this way, so let's go this way. Bowler status, rollout station. I've been doing voices too much, my throat is dying. Anyway, let's do bowler. As a weapon, I just wonder how this is going to work. And let's pay a hundred to go in. Okay. Get to the goal before the timer runs out. Oh boy. I didn't... <laughs> they could have, like, given me a second. It's fine. Also, how do I jump with B? 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 <sighs> Please. Please. No. Take a ride on those dash tracks. Well, I, I would if I could jump that high. Once we can press hold as you got to detonate, painting the area around us. I don't know how helpful that is. But it's fine. Dash, there we go. Someone's there. I'm gonna blow you up, please. Just like that, and then jump over here. Oh, wow. Oh, we can actually go up the wall. Scanners didn't pick up any vital signs from the Octarian. Interesting. It's like they're fake Octarians. I don't know how that works. Also, where am I going? Up this way, please. The ball should be able to jump on top of those ink sticks. Interesting. Oh, oh, interesting. Very interesting. Ink sticks again. Don't hold my back. Now charge. Hold. Don't hold back. Now charge. No. No. Why? I don't like that effect. Also, there's no extra lives. We just have three lives. The ball should be able to jump on top of those ink sticks. Yep. But also, you have huge knockbacks. So you need to be careful. Okay, jump. Jump. Careful, 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 Okay, we have time. We have time. I think we have more time than we had before, so I'm not sure where that time came from. Don't, don't do that. I don't like knockback. Even if it is helpful, knockback. <sighs> to attempt to test again, you must pay the fee again. Might as well just start from the last checkpoint. Same amount of costs, so. As just going back to the beginning. 
as far as I can tell. Hopefully I'm not wrong about that. Go, 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 go. Why? I don't like knockback. <laughs> it, it's... Yes, you can jump over them, but also, why would you want to? <gasps> okay. Please. Okay. Explode, please. And go. Okay, test passed. Get 600 things. CQ points. And another mem cake. I just don't like knockback. Oh my goodness, it's fine. I'm probably, it probably would be better if I wasn't trying to jump too quickly. We can also imagine Incopolis by pressing plus now on this screen. And that takes us back to Incopolis. So while this inkling is just imagining what the surface might be like, we actually just swap back to our other character. But anyway, it looks like this area here is uh, a, a, uh, a, an intersection. So it's got, it's B01, which is also A03. So it's gonna actually go onto a different track. But anyway, signs point to yes. What's up, 8 Pole Station? What's up? Okay, let's see what we have. Guide the 8 Pole to the goal with the spl splash matic Please lead the 8 Pole to the goal, keeping in mind that the 8 Pole will damage any enemies it touches. Shoot it carefully, but powerfully. Take care out there. Once again, please leave the A-Ball to the goal. Okay. Have to pay 200 to get in, but we get 800 back, so we might get... Oh, there it goes. Yeah! This is an interesting weapon. Oh, don't shoot that. Don't shoot that. Only I can shoot that. At least there's no timer. Take you out. I like the rapid fire of this gun. It's quite nice. It's a good weapon. As far as I can tell. Oh boy. Oh boy. Careful. It's kind of got holes to jump around, but also I probably could have just brought it over to begin with, but I want to take that guy out first, so let me go around. Also, that shot was taking a while to go where it needs to go, but anyway. Send that over there, carefully. Let me shoot you. Get some more CQ points. Up we go. Please don't fall off the edge. Actually, get off the edge now. <laughs> okay, it's fine. It's just very precise stuff that it wants me to do here. Talk about an uphill battle. Oh, yes indeed. Try getting it onto that rail first. Try getting onto the rail in the middle. Don't go too far. No, oh, there it goes. If it, if it falls off the edge, I get exploded. So I have to be careful. Okay, so it's on the rail now. Oh boy. Now I can try and do something like that. To roll over that way. Simply splendid. Well, that was a fun thing. If we went past that, you can go back with that rail there. Which is actually interesting because that's an, that's an ink rail, not a uh, skate rail. Or whatever that's called. I'm pretty sure that that's what they're called. Head across the seesaw in a single dash. Oh, it's a seesaw. Oh boy, oh boy, oh, don't fall off, don't fall off, don't fall off, don't fall off, don't fall off. Okay. Okay. I see an eight ball switch in front of the vault. So we send that in there. That's activated now. But I guess you're not going to be able to get the ball onto it. Okay. There's also this path here, which is interesting. I think that might be on the way back or something. Yeah, I think we have to go this way first as just ourselves and then open that up and then... Oh, there's a thing in there. Okay. Interesting. Also, we can't use our sub weapon with this because it doesn't allow us to. I kind of like this kind of idea of mixing things up. You have to use the weapon you have and not use anything else. Key located. Oh, careful camera, camera please. I'm glad I'm playing with a pro controller right now because I think Joy-Cons would be interesting. Hurry up and get the key. Okay, well, let's grab that. Also, there's like 
bubblegum strips just floating in the background, I guess. I think that's what that is. This place looks really cool just when I just take a second to look at everything. I couldn't really do that in the previous level because of the timer, but I can in this one and I'm pleased about it, so. Launch! How did that launch so far? I need to get up there quickly. Keep an eye out there. Seesaw lowers up and down. Okay. Well, at least they'll stay balanced for the most part. Please, 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 please. Looks like a roll across the seesaw. We just need to get to the goal. And there we go. Test passed. Okay, so that's an eight ball station. Which there will be, there'll be more of these types of tests as we go forward. That seems like a good start, so. We've discovered line B. You have now unlocked two lines. You can view them on the deep sea metro map. Stations marked with this icon of, of energy, I don't know. Contain one of the four things. Seek them out. I'd like to offer you a reward for finding this new line. Please pay me a visit. Oh, by the way, while you've been out there passing tests, Captain Cuttlefish had some time on his hands, so we've been chatting with him. We thought you might be in interested, so we made the chat log available viewable to you. Use L and R to select the chat logs on your CQ80. Take a look sometime. Well, that sounds pretty cool. Also, these guys are interesting. Interesting, to say the least. Oh, they make noises when I boop them. Fun. As a reward for arriving at a new line, allow me to grant you some CQ points. Nice. Please accept these 500. Very nice. Let's go check out that chat log, though. Session 1. Webmaster. DJ, DJ Hyperfresh has joined the chat room. Hey, anyone here yet? Hello? MC Princess has joined the chat room. Ayo, hey, it's Pearl, aka MC Princess, aka the Baroness, Baroness of Bars, aka uh, MC Foreign Policy. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Oh, snap, it's Marina. Hey, Pearl. Aka DJ, DJ Hyperfresh. AK DJ Cold Breakfast, AK the Fuzzy Dazzler, AK DJ Catch and Release. Craig Cuttlefish has joined the chat room. I love that it has like his full name there. Bah, dude's screen name is just his first and last name. Gotta love old people, lol. Hi, Captain Cuttlefish. Can you see the chat room okay? On your cell phones? Oh, no, no, that, that, that was the wrong character, it's fine. I can see it's just fine, thanks for asking. But all my letters are big for some reason. Hit the caps lock key cap. It should be the button in the lower left, depending on your, your, your phone. By the way, I was able to hack into the CQ80, so Agent 8 should be able to see our chat logs. Cuttlefish. <laughs> Test I am Cat Captain Cuttlefish, or Cuttlefish. Agent 8, we'll send you a dump of our latest chat, chat logs every few stages. Keep an eye out. Yo, Cap, how did you even type like that? You gotta show me. Captain Cuttlefish is pretty cool. But we can also check here the uh, mem cakes that we have from the different lines that we have. And apparently there's a C line, so we'll find that. We actually have 3 out of 80 levels completed now, apparently. So there's probably a fair bit to do here. But there we go. We can also change Octoling's uh, setup here if we wanted to as well. But because of um, the Octo expansion, you can also, once you have it, use your Octoling that you design here in multiplayer battles in Incopolis. So, although that might be later, possibly, I don't know. I don't know if you need to complete the Deep Sea Metro to do that or not. So, but anyway, that is it for now. So, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.